in these problems, we are trying to figure out the area of these complicated figures made up of rectangles all shoved together. The way to do this is to draw some lines to split them up into uh, you know, single rectangles so that you can figure out the area of a rectangle by multiplying the length times the width and then adding the pieces together. So I think in this one, I could just do one line right across here and I'd have two rectangles. Now, this one down on the bottom, I can see a width of three and a length of three. So this is three by three, which is nine. So that's easy. This one, I see a width here of two, but what's the total length here? There's a five and there's a five, but I don't have a length up here. So this is the, the one little trick in these problems. You might have to do some addition to get a length or maybe sometimes even some subtraction. So I want to go from this point to this point and find that distance. And you'll notice from here to here is five. And then from here to here is three. And then from here to here is another five. So if I go across here and then across here and then across here, it's the same distance as going all the way across the top. So this length up here is five plus three plus five or 13 meters. So that is our distance across the top. So our um, our area in this piece is going to be 2 times 13, which is 26. So now our two pieces are 26 and 9. We just need to add those together. So 26 plus 9, that equals 35. And then we need the right unit. This is measured in meters, but area is squared. So this is meters squared, and that is our answer. Let's try another one of those. Okay, so this one, I think one line will do it too to chop it up. I'll just draw right through here. And hmm, right away, I see I'm missing that length. So let me come back to that. Let's see if we've got the big one. It's five wide and eight long. Okay, so this is five times eight. That's 40. That was easy enough. Now, how do I figure out what this length is right here? Well, on this side, the total is eight. And on this side, I know that from here to here is five and from here to here, I don't have, but it's gotta be the rest of the way to get to eight. So the length here is eight minus five or three yards. So this did kind of look like a square. It actually is. It's a three by three square. So this is three by three and that area is nine. So I've got 40 and I've got nine, that equals 49, and the units are gonna be yards squared. So that is a little bit of work with figuring out the areas of these um, composite rectangular figures.